We're hearing from the man at the heart of the center of that confrontation with food cart vendors outside SoFi Stadium. Just one day after being fired, the worker issued a public apology. Eyewitness News reporter Eric Resendez was there when he spoke to reporters. Instead of making money Saturday night outside of SoFi Stadium, street vendors were seen picking up their food after their carts were knocked down. One vendor says items from the cart hit her daughter, leaving her with bruises. Marvin Carroll is the man taking responsibility. Carroll worked for a third-party vendor at the stadium. Civil rights activists joined Carroll Wednesday as he apologized for the incident. It was never my intent to harm any kids if they were, if they were harmed. Um, so I express my apologies to them. Ahead of the press conference, the civil rights activist said Carroll was fired after he knocked over a hot dog stand and injured a girl in the process. Vendors say Carroll asked them to step away from the stadium entrance, and they did. But then said afterward, Carroll came back arguing. Person yes, I asked him multiple times. I asked him multiple times to step back. He began to get irate and talk, you know, and to disrespect. Hey, I'm sorry. I did not push the car. Now what happened? Tell us what happened. There's a video camera. Once they release the video camera, you can be able to see. Organizers say they facilitated the apology to clarify any false narrative. Well, the false narrative is that he is racist and that he hurt the kids. So I know his children, and his children are Latinos. You asking me, do I condemn it? Well, that's the reason I reached out to Marvin because we're not going for that in our community. We're not hurting people, no matter who the people are. Both the vendors and the organizers are asking SoFi to pay the vendors for the money they lost that night, but SoFi hasn't responded yet. Inglewood police say as of now, Carol has not been arrested, and this is an ongoing investigation. In Inglewood, Eric Resendiz, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.